Duke Ellington was the most significant and prolific composer in jazz history. At the height of his career, after years of unprecedented success, he dared to compose an extended length jazz composition not for the nightclub, but for the concert hall. This was a deeply felt musical experience called Black, Brown, and Beige. It was a musical journey that told the story of the African-American experience from slavery to the Harlem Renaissance. He proudly debuted Black, Brown, and Beige in 1943 in New York City's Carnegie Hall. He wrote the notes that the world wasn't ready to hear. It was dismissed by critics and never performed in its entirety again. Until now, on January 26th in Steinmetz Hall, Black, Brown, and Beige will come alive again. This brilliant work was ahead of its time. The time has now come. 80 years after its debut, very special guest Audra McDonald will join the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra along with members of the Jazz Orchestra at Dr. Phillips Center, players from Jazz at Lincoln Center, and the Bethune-Cookman University Concert Chorale to honor Ellington's most significant work. This monumental evening will feature the professional world premiere of the orchestration of Black, Brown, and Beige in sacred music. <laughs>